In the American Revolution during the Battle of Monmouth, Mary McCulley would bring fresh water to her husband and his parched artillery crew, thus earning herself the nickname Molly Pitcher. It's Loud Kiddington and his dog, Fitch. If you're tired of all grown, talk too loud. Better hurry here today and beat the crowd. If you want to buy a wheel, forget that volcano. Talk too loud, talk too loud, talk too loud. Howdy, Roman citizens. Loud Kiddington here. And if I can't make you a deal, my dog, Fetch will the metal muffin. Yes, sir, You too can enjoy vacations living on its fire. Actually, this battle lasted a good three weeks. And after weeks of fighting in the hot sun, it's time for a drink of cool, refreshing water. Thanks, Molly Pitcher. You're a lifesaver. Ding, 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 ding! We have a winner! Hey, Captain! We just ran out of water! Land ho! You look like you could use a nice, refreshing glass of water. Thanks, Molly. I mean, orders is orders, and we had ours. And women wearing parts is totally against the way we do things around here. I mean, it's the Middle Ages. It's what we call heresy, isn't it? Abe, I feel your pain. Who wants water? So come on down to Samaria and buy a wheel. Because if you don't, my dog Fetch here will eat a big pile of elephant plop. Talk too loud, talk too loud, talk too loud. Water? Misinformation in... Hysteria! Welcome to President of Hollywood's Home Movies with your host, Lord Tiddleton. Ow, misinformation. And now my guy who's more taxi than a politician, Loud Kennington. Thank you, Miss Hitler. Thank you, I'll be paying you all up later. Here's the first clip and break the ice. Thruster to base. I'm going in. Only one creature could create so much destruction. The hideous, people eating. Ooh. <laughs> my name's George Jamel, and I like to yell. I never lose my cool, because I rule the school. And... <laughs> My name is John, and this is my third grade class, and we're talking all about fire and fire safety. <laughs> okay, here's the moment you've been waiting for. The ice cream truck's here? <laughs> no, silly. The three finalists for presidential funniest home movies. Jumpin' Jackalopes, Monteni Signal. They must need my help at the canal. By commanding the largest and most powerful invasion force in history. Look, I'd love to chat, but I've got a continent to take back from the Germans. Just remember, if you're worried about your hair, and who isn't these days, use your walkie-talkie to call the No Hair Club closest to you. Do it today. Yeah, yeah. crap. Holy okay, so I wasn't the first one to say it, but I meant it. No, wait, I, I didn't mean that. I, I never lie. Oops. <laughs> there I go again. Yeah, yeah. crap. Holy We're going to get letters. <laughs> President.
presidential home movie. Will it be Lincoln Law, Fireside Cat, or Give Him Help Harry? And the winner is Abraham Lincoln. Bullet. Any plans on how you're going to spend your winning? I've got the constitution of a bull moose, the strength of an elephant, and my back's more hairy than a chimpanzee. Make that a hard hat. <laughs> Remember, keep those cameras rolling. And maybe you could be the next world leader on presidential funniest home movies. Nah!